<laughs> hey, do not embarrass me when he comes out here. I don't want any oon or any of that crap. This man is a guest here and he's not to be ooed. I mean it. I, at home too. No ooing at home unless you're ooing for entirely different reasons. Please welcome the wonderful Simon Cowell, everybody, Simon Cowell. Welcome. Those are the questions, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, you weren't beginning now. Okay. How are you? Oh, you're enjoying your cup. I'll enjoy a drink too, Simon. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Tasteful. There's no favouritism here. The guests get treated just as well as I do. <laughs> it's awesome, isn't it? Classy. Yeah, yeah, thanks. It's a uh, snake. Mm. Not, not a real one. Not it's a real clay. one, no. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's a very cheap snake. It is, but... Hey, don't it! You can do them now! <laughs> To say I don't, I have never thought that you were the meanest uh, judge on Idol because I thought you always just told the truth. Of course. And and do you think that people have a problem here in the truth? Is that what it is? Well, if you're a contestant, yes. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know, I was always brought up, uh, probably like you. To, oh, you, you know, weren't brought up like me, so <laughs> what? If come you, on, Simon. Come on. Well, no, I, start, I didn't meet anyone called Simon until I was thirty. You know. <laughs> It's a slightly different side of the tracks. <laughs> if you're rubbish, you're rubbish. Right, you right, know, right. And <laughs> not you. No, no, I no, get it. Not I you. get it. Yeah, not yeah. you. Um, bit. Um, but uh, <laughs> no, that's just the way it is. You know, if you're if you're terrible, you're terrible. And so therefore, I think what I'm doing is a kind of a kindness. I think so as well. Because no, I'm serious. <laughs> I really I do. Do. Because you you see a lot of people in this town who they've come here to believe in they're great, and they're not so great, and they end up hosting talk shows in the middle of the damn night because they don't. <laughs> Well, you could say the same about Ryan, um, but... Oh, yeah! He's done fine. I warned you! Um, boo as much as you like. No, do not! <laughs> I'm used to it. Do you, do you really have a problem with Ryan Seacrest? Do you really? No, be honest. There's nobody watching. Okay. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Uh, Ryan, we have a relationship, like, uh, we call them Alsatians, I think in America you call them German Shepherds. German Shepherds, right. yeah. I'm a German Shepherd, right? Right, right. Ryan is like a sausage dog, you know? <laughs> no, I, now, is there any truth to that rumour as well? Because I, I heard he was a sausage dog, but I didn't know. <laughs> Not that kind. All right, But okay, you know yeah. how, like, the little dogs always try and get the attention of the bigger dog, and it kind of, like, chews at the bottom of your leg, or... <laughs> gets on your leg and does all that stuff and it's kind of like, oh, just get off, Ryan. That, <laughs> that is my relationship. Um, well, that seems perfectly normal. Yeah, it's, a, it's a big dog, little dog, but he's kind of cute, but annoying. Yeah. <laughs> all right, I think that's... Is he farty? I've got a little dog that's very farty. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> I've never got that close, but probably, yeah. Now, yeah, you, you start... Oh, listen, tell me about this woman uh, from Scotland, actually, of all places. The, uh, the, the singer woman that was on the uh, British version. Uh, it was so, so you think you've got a pop star in your hands or something. Yeah. <laughs> and the, the Scottish woman that sings... What's her name again? Susan Boyle, well the, the Scottish woman, yeah. You couldn't remember either, I, I was going to say Susan. Um, oh, you were. Right. Uh, we were in Glasgow, and we, we weren't having a great day. Um, <laughs> Tell and, me about uh, it. Yeah. It, it, was, it was a long day, and uh, when we do the auditions, I don't know who's ever going to come on, and on this show we have the audience behind us, and this little old lady came out, who I thought was a little old lady, mm. and uh, asked her how old she was, and she said she was 47. She looked about 80, to be honest with you. <laughs> But she did. Hey! Oh, it's 78. All oh, right, right, yeah. Um, and, um, and the audience were laughing at her. I was kind of like, oh, this is going to last five seconds, just get on with it. And, uh, and then she started to sing, and it was just it's one incredible. of those special, special auditions. It was, uh, actually, it's, on the, it's all over the YouTube. Do we have a little clip of it from the YouTube? Let's, let's have a little look at it for those the people who haven't seen it. Okay, what's the dream? I, I'm trying to be a professional singer. And why hasn't it worked out so far, Susan? Well, I've never been given the chance before, but he's hoping it'll change. I dreamed a dream in time gone by. Before. 
That's astonishing, really, isn't it? Look, what does it say? What does it say about us as a society? Uh, if we, someone who comes on who doesn't look like Beyonce can sing. I mean, surely, surely, you know, people who are not well, smoking hot can sing. Not that that woman's not smoking hot. To, no, I did know. say after, I did say after the clip, I had a feeling you were going to be fantastic, and I was right. You did say that after the I clip. I actually said that. You yeah. lying sack of crap. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you, you didn't think it, did you? <laughs> no. no, I genuinely didn't. But I thought, you know what? It's going to be in the tape anyway, so I'm just going to say it. Right. But it's astonishing because you know she she was like you know living on her own. She lives with a cat and oh. literally. Wait a minute. Let me just mock surprise there for a minute. <laughs> Never been kissed. Right. Um, never been kissed. Never been kissed. And, oh no! And, and she's had like a hundred million hits in a week or something. It's it's astonishing. What's that is. There. It's, a, it's a, a. I think there's a movie in that. Who's got the movie rights to that? No. Did you? <laughs> did you buy the movie rights to her story? I was story? thinking about it. I you would did. It. No, I, I I haven't, but I would uh, definitely. I think it'd be a great movie. Remember that time you were so, I'm just that... imagining you in a wig, actually. Oh, I did. <laughs> You don't have to imagine being a wig. Watch this show any yeah, day of the say, week. <laughs> it's all there. You've got very nice hair, actually. Thank you. Do you think it's a British thing, nice hair? Well, obviously not. <laughs> Why? Why? We were getting on so well, and then suddenly you've gone after me. Why? Ish. No. Yeah. It's... I don't try and sing. I don't go. Oh. So I don't. I'm not part of your target I'm still audience. Looking at your hair. Um, What's wrong with my hair? You keep looking at it. Why? It's a bit of a mess. Oh, really? It's almost like a sort of an arranged mess as well. <laughs> well it, it reflects the nature of the show. Is what we're trying to do. Here. <laughs> no, I just it grows and I cut it occasionally. No, you look great. Yeah, no, you. I like what you do that thing to make your biceps look bigger when you do that thing. <laughs> you know that thing that you do. Mention that. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, no. Quits. No, all right. Quits. All right. Okay. I'm just saying, I'm yeah. a guy. Okay, I no, know no, the no. tricks I'm too. With you. All right. I know, I'm yeah. with you. It's your show. I'm the guy. All right. Yeah. All right. They were your just audience. Saying. No. <laughs> when the uh, when I heard this story, and it must have been about a year ago, two years ago, where you were offered by a couple to judge them having sex. Is that true? Is that a true thing? It is true, actually, yeah. I was in a restaurant, uh, and a couple came over to me and said, uh, we'll pay you, um, I think it was a hundred or a hundred and fifty thousand dollars. What? If I went home with them to judge them having sex. <laughs> and, uh, How was the sex? Well, Mr. Stupid said no. You said no? Uh, <laughs> so, if you're watching, <laughs> with inflation, it's now 250. <laughs> But I am available. I mean, I seriously... Would, seriously would, you, would you do it now? Yeah, because there was no ending to the story. It's kind of like, it starts off interesting, like you offer the money, yes, and then I said no, so there's no ending to the story. So, uh, I absolutely should have taken the money. Yeah, 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 no, you, you yeah. should have taken the money. Now listen, if you would just like, like a, a layman's opinion, I mean, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not a big tiny guy, but I'll, I'll watch, uh, you know... Hey, you know what? I'll do it for nothing. <laughs> we have to take a break. Will you come back? All right. Simon Cowell when we come back, everybody.